So what will happen is when you, and especially when you get to the level that you are, you can have an upgrade that fast in like a very short period. It doesn't take that long. Yeah, that's cool. It really doesn't because as you clarify, you have to remember, it all comes down to how high your frequency resonance is. Right. The higher your frequency resonance, the faster things can shift for you in the physical. Why? Because you've cleared out enough of your distortion patterns from not only spirit level, but from the physical, mental, emotional level, mm -hmm. right? By mm -hmm. confirming the removal and doing all the stuff we've always talked about, mm -hmm. that you're clear enough that when the upgrade happens, you shift right with it. Right? It's like, boom, you just become more efficient. That's what efficiency is on the spirit level. You, you, that's what coherence is, right? Mm. This is when you're, when you're coherent, you're having coherence between the spirit and the physical and the level in between. So that means the whole system becomes much, much, much more harmonious, much more efficient. So when spirit moves, everything moves with it, mm. right? And then you can have an upgrade as fast as you do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. And like you cool. said, it happens in your sleep. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, I've had them too where I I often listen to them as I'm going to bed. Yeah. And I'll have dreams. Yeah. I've told you where I'm like f literally faced with yes. the distortions that are most challenging for me. Yeah. Like holding my space or yeah. saying no, you know. Yeah. And then I'm doing it in my sleep, sleep. and then boom. It's done. Yeah. yeah. Really cool. And dreams. I'm so glad you brought that up mm -hmm. because sometimes your dreams will show you because the quality of your dream state will shift. So meaning, so what you um, described was awesome because it was just about um, using your dream space to actually detox. That's yep. what you're doing, yeah. which is really fantastic. And when your dreams shift, often they will show you things like you've shifted. Like, do you know what I mean? Like you'll like you'll, the theme of them, the theme or? of them, or what you encounter, oh. or what you're mm -hmm. presented with, mm -hmm. or the knowledge that you're given, mm -hmm. or what you what they pretend. Like meaning, like some people in their dreams know that something's going to happen. Oh, right? They have yeah. an awareness that this is going to happen, and it happens to be, becomes more and more accurate mm -hmm. as they jump in their frequency resonance. Cool. So your dreams can be, depending on who you are, and if you're a dreamer, right. like in that way, like some people are really strong in their and dreams. And some don't remember their dreams. Some don't remember. It, you don't have to you remember have dreams to. for this to, yeah. Yeah. So, but in that dream space, it can also reflect those upgrade moments, right, where you're like jumping in yeah. your frequency resonance. Yeah. I, yeah, I think I've had that because I'll have like a theme of this, this being showing up in different um, different appearances where mm. they're testing me on something and they're like, I didn't pass, didn't pass, and then passed. Yeah. You know? It's yeah. like, oh, cool. That's yeah. like some proof. Right yeah. There. And then yeah. you can feel that and you're like, and then when you yeah. wake up the next morning, do you feel different? Oh, yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then it shows up in my, uh, like I'll often get tested, whether mm -hmm. it's like a client or something where I'm having to hold my space and mm -hmm. say no, and then I'm, I can do it. Yeah. Way better. Oh, that's interesting. Than before. Yeah. Yeah, because you're stronger because of the upgrade that happened in the dream space.